A human being would hurt a dolphin, but the folks at the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration want to find whoever is responsible for shooting one and stabbing another along Florida beaches. NOAA is actually offering a $20,000 reward for any information that leads to an arrest after the animals were found dead in Naples and Pensacola last month. Tennis reporter Liz Birch set out to answer the question that everyone is asking. Who would do something like this? These are shocking cases. They're, they're really horrific cases. Noah says the dolphins that were harmed were most likely fed fish in the past, which made them too comfortable with humans. They say they were then intentionally harmed. While they can't speak to specifically who did this or why, former FBI agent Dave Kuvatier says there are two types of people who tend to abuse animals. So, the irresponsible, immature adult or that juvenile making bad decisions because of peer pressure, uh, trying to be cruel. He says the other type worries him more. More concerning um, the profile of the sinister individual who actually gets gratification or sexually aroused by hurting living things. He says those people can be connected to other crimes. Those are the ones that we read about or that we hear about um, from time to time that start off by bedwetting, starting fires, killing small animals, and then they graduate to domestic abuse or even worse. And at the Clearwater Marine Aquarium, senior rescue biologist Carrie Sanchez says the best thing most people can do to protect these beautiful creatures is simply to leave them alone so they don't want to approach boats or people in the future. The most important thing is we can keep wild dolphins wild. And that means not interacting them in any way, shape, or form in the wild. And so one, one other thing to note, Noah says, sometimes these dolphins become so used to being fed that they will annoy fishermen on their boats. Unfortunately, deadly attacks on dolphins is not a new thing. According to Noah, at least 29 dolphins have been killed by guns, arrows, or fishing spears since 2002. Four of those cases actually just happened within the last year. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission and NOAA continue to look into these attacks. It is illegal, by the way, to feed, harass, hunt, or kill wild dolphins. Anyone caught and prosecuted can face up to a year in jail and a $100,000 fine per violation.